Hey up guys, Dazinator here again, and I'm going to bring you another glitch again. I am not the finder of this glitch, I don't take credit for this glitch, but I'm going to show you an easier way of doing it using a macro to get unlimited IVE entry spaces. So you can either use a macro using JBit or any sort of macro recorder on the PC, but if you're on Xbox, once again we're going to be using the uh, Battle crossover adapter. This will let us macro any Xbox or PlayStation, basically, you know, the A, X buttons, triangle buttons, any button on the Xbox controller or the PlayStation controller. This will work on any console. Plug this into the controller and we're going to macro it so that we can get unlimited inventory spaces while we can go and, I don't know, make a cup of tea, make a coffee. And then come back and have unlimited inventory spaces. All right, so let's get into this video, and I'll show you how it's done. All right, so I'm gonna get straight into this one, guys. You wanna head over to your perks and make sure you've got the armorer perk to level three. It will not work if you're not level three because you need the level three armorer. So you can put the pocket uh, perk on your level we're about to make. So you want to go over to a workbench and you've got to love how these uh, things just disappear when they want to. But you know, that's not important right now. So you want to go over to the armor workbench and craft uh, a leather piece uh, that you want. Then switch over to modify and basically modify the arm piece and make sure it has the deep pocketed perk on. Like I said we need the armorer as you can see to the right so we can do this. So back out of that and then once you have it switch over to the pit boy and then you'll be able to find the deep pocketed uh, perked left arm what you just made. So this is where I'm going to use my rapid fire pad and time lapse uh, me going into the negatives and then we'll be right back. So enjoy this little time lapse. So basically, taking this on and off because uh, it's the effect. It makes our, uh, uh, our entry spaces go down into the negatives. So basically then we've, we can do this as limited times we want and get unlimited our entry space. Alright, let's do this. All right, as you can see, well, a little under 2,500 in negative. Uh, but with the legit inventory spaces that we have, that puts us around 2,665 inventory spaces. So at this point, open in your stash, like ammo, even your junk, you could put all this into your adventure. I mean, I don't recommend doing that because someone can steal your, your junk, Gegada. But um, at this point, the XP exploit, where you get tons of fuel and grenades, at least you could then carry those grenades to a vendor and get and sell those, sell them for caps. So if you don't have a rapid fire pad. Or if you don't have a, any sort of macro program, you could do this by just pressing it with your finger, but it's going to take quite some time. It's up to you how you do it. But yeah, this is the unlimited carry exploit glitch. Alright guys, like, comment and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Doesn't it out.